Kristen. I am a fifth year teacher teaching second and third grade this year. And welcome to the first day of classroom setup. So as you can see, my car is packed full. I literally have no room for anything else. Um, I just stopped at Home Depot and got a tape measure because I didn't have one and I forgot to borrow my boyfriend's. So um, we are headed to school and we're gonna unload everything and start with day one. So let's go. super sweaty now. Whew. All right, I was lucky enough to have my car right here, which is amazing. So um, I'm going to drive it back around and park it in the front so I don't have to worry about that later. Okay, so I'm trying to figure out where I want to put my desk. Um, I'm thinking I want it with my kidney table so it's a whole like teacher area, but I'm not really sure. I think my library is going to go somewhere over there. Um, I really want these bulletin boards to be able to, um, like, have the students interact with them. So I don't really want to put anything in that. I think my rug is probably going to go up next to the board because I have a different rug for the classroom library. Um, so I think I'm going to try and move all of this so I can put the kidney table and my teacher desk in that corner. And then... The phone's over here, but that's fine. I can just put something else at the phone. I just talked to the janitor and I think we're gonna try and get me tables instead of desks so some more tables instead of the desks right there because I do a lot of group work so that would probably just make the most sense anyway so she's gonna try and figure that out for me so hopefully we can get that figured out sooner rather than later um, but yeah I also wasn't sure if those bookshelves could move but they actually can move so I'm trying to figure out where I want to put those now too and this file cabinet is really hard to move as well so we're gonna try and figure out where to put that and I need to take down all of this um, just so I can get stuff that matches my theme more and I need to take down all of that color as well so let's do that <laughs> a little bit and I'm very indecisive right now um, I'm trying to figure out what works for my teacher area and what works for the student desks and which cabinets and shelves should go where so I'm a little like flustered at the moment and 
I'm sweating profusely, so that's fun. But yeah, it's been a little bit since I checked in. I'm gonna just like show you what I have so far and if there are any suggestions that you have, then that would be greatly appreciated. Okay, so when I walk in, I moved the rug up here, which I think I like it up here. It looks really good. I'm um, not sure what I'm gonna put there yet, but I did move this cabinet over here next to this cabinet, so it's just kind of all in one space. I have this little desk that I still need to spray paint white. Sorry, backing up. Um, put out my nice little door mat though. I'm gonna keep these bookshelves here, I think, because I think my classroom library is gonna go right here, so I'll kind of make kind of an extension or I'm not really sure exactly what yet, but that's all my classroom library stuff. I gotta put together those bookshelves and still organize it somehow because I haven't done that yet. I am going to put a display right here of student work. Um, that'll be some really pretty colors. I still have to take down all this bulletin board. Um, I think this is how my tables are going to stay, at least for right now. I should be getting either two more longer ones like that or three more shorter ones because I should have about 25 kids. It'll be four, six, four, and then we'll see how much, what other types of tables they can find. Um, but yeah, the teacher area is, I think I've moved it around about 50 times and I think this is what we are sticking with for the moment so that way if somebody does like pop into my room they also would have a place to sit too which would be great um but i wanted to have the whiteboard behind my kidney table so i could use that as a um tool while i'm teaching there so yeah um i'm gonna put my affirmation mirror over here and yeah, I think we're doing okay, but yeah, we're making some progress. I just haven't even touched my crates yet. I'm just trying to figure out the layout first and then we will figure it out. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago Alright, so we got all of that paper off and I took out every single staple on the board so it's nice and clean. So there's all the paper. I might save that green paper to use for like a craft or something like that. Um, but I'm not sure yet. Okay, I think that's it for day one. Didn't really get as much done as I wanted to, but that's okay. Um, we'll be back tomorrow, hopefully bright and early, and I can get a lot done. I don't have access to the printer yet, so I can't really make anything look like finished until I have that, but hopefully I'm supposed to get my badge, fingers crossed, tomorrow. And yeah, once I get my badge, then I can use the copier and the printer. I did get my laptop though, so that's good. Um, but yeah, we are going to head home and then I'm headed out to go to my friend's house um, to have bachelor girls night and we are going to relax and enjoy what summer we do have left. Um, but not to say I'm not excited for setting up the rest of my classroom because I definitely am. I just am a little discouraged right now because I wanted to get a lot more done today than I actually did. So yeah, um, we will see you tomorrow. If I don't vlog later tonight, then I will see you in the morning. If I do, I'll just show you some of the spread from tonight. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna end the video here. Um, please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, um, comment down below when you start school, if you've started school already. And yeah, 
see you next time okay so they didn't have nerds gummy clusters but i got something just as good i got both of these and they're delicious so i'm bringing these to um girls night